A man who knocked a stranger unconscious outside a late night bar in Nottingham has been jailed for what the judge called a savage attack. Ricky Scott handed himself in after the police released shocking CCTV of the attack to this programme. Our social affairs correspondent Jeremy Ball has more. A vicious single punch. Michael Caine was left out cold in the street with a fractured skull simply for talking to a woman who appeared to be upset. Today her boyfriend arrived at Nottingham Crown Court prepared for a stretch in prison. Ricky Scott said he was very ashamed and wanted to apologise but the courts heard that Michael's injuries were so severe that he had to be fed through a straw. The judge said the attack was savage, unwarranted and unprovoked, that Scott was fuelled by anger and that he made matters worse by claiming that he was provoked by a racist slur, when really he was incensed that Michael had spoken to his girlfriend. Ricky Scott had just left the Bamboo Club in Nottingham's Lace Market where he'd been drinking with his friends. The courts heard that his victim was visiting the city from Scotland for a poker tournament. Scott eventually handed himself in after the police released these CCTV pictures as Michael spoke to this programme to make a personal appeal for information. I fractured my skull and it was um, bleeding into my brain as well so I had to be rushed straight into intensive care and had an operation on my skull um, and I also broke my jaw. I don't know why he would have done it. That's a question his attacker is going to have plenty of time to contemplate. This evening Scott was driven away to begin a jail sentence of more than two and a half years. Seven months on Michael's recovering but the court heard that what happened here has changed his life. Jeremy Ball, BBC's Midlands Today, Nottingham.